Good morning and welcome to today's video. We are doing our grocery pickups today, so I'm gonna be doing a grocery haul for you. Uh, we already got our Walmart order picked up and actually our HEB order got delayed and so we're just kind of driving around and waiting for them to contact us and tell us that our order is ready. So um, today is going to be a little bit different. We have a bit of a smaller haul than usual. We are leaving this week to go on a road trip and so today's focus is mostly going to be on um, doing our road trip snacks and things like that. I don't have a lot of meal stuff because we're really trying to eat through what we have at the house so that uh, we're not leaving much behind while we're gone. So um, there's a few things that we're that are going to be for the week, but mostly it's going to be focused on road trip snacks. So I'll be showing you that. So we are just going to finish running our errands here and finishing our grocery pickups and then we will see you back at home. Okay, so we are back home now and I have everything laid out here. Um, if this is your first time watching one of my grocery hauls, every week I do two grocery pickups. I do one at HEB, which is a local Texas grocery chain, and I also do one at Walmart. The HEB has a really good weekly ad, and so I like to get some of the deals off of there. And then sometimes there's just things that are cheaper at Walmart. So I go between the two places, try to find the best deals for the week. Um, this week, again, is a little bit different because we're mostly buying for our road trip that we have coming up. So it's a little bit different than what we would usually get. We are trying to keep it under 150 this week. Um, we're right at the end of our month, so we are trying to keep it low spend the last couple of weeks. I ended up spending uh, 51.11 at HEB and 51.76 at Walmart for a total of 102.87 for today, um, which is pretty good. So we're gonna use the extra money and we're gonna use it for our date night tonight. So my husband and I like to have a date night on Saturday nights and a lot of times we'll just make food at home. But with our extra money that we saved for this week, I think we're gonna do some takeout food tonight. So I'll be looking forward to that. So I have a setup here where um, this is my HEB stuff here. Here is my Walmart order. And then here in the middle, these things are actually from Target. I went to Target yesterday and um, just to look for some activities and things for the car. So I thought I'd go ahead and show that as well while I'm showing our grocery orders. So um, we're gonna start on the HEB side. So we got two boxes of Fruity Pebbles this week, which I would normally not buy. In fact, I don't think that I have ever bought these before, but these were on sale this week. If I got two boxes, I thought it would be something kind of fun for the kids, something that we don't normally do. So I went ahead and I got those this week. We got four bunches of bananas, two green and two yellow. And whatever is left of these by the time that we leave this week, we will bring with us on the trip. We also got a bag of apples and same thing, whatever isn't eaten, we will bring with us on the road. Um, for some of our snacks here, I got these Go Go Squeeze yogurts. We actually got these um, on a deal a couple of weeks ago and the kids really liked them and they don't require uh, refrigeration. So I thought that those would be really good to bring with us just as a snack for the kids. Um, here I have these two bags of cashews. This one is a green, a hatch green chili flavor and this one is Thai curry, which I haven't had these ones but they sounded really good and I've had these before and they're delicious. So that's kind of a treat mostly for, um, for me and my husband on the road. I also got some of this, um, uh, some of these smoked sausages here. These are some of my husband's favorites, so um, those will be for the road as well. I got spicy jalapeno in the original to try. I got a box of these um, grilled cheese crackers. My kids love these. Every one of them just goes crazy over these, and so I thought these would be good to bring with us and an easy car snack. And then um, at HEB, every week they do a meal deal. So if you purchase an entree, um, then it'll come with some free sides to complete the meal. So this week it was pizza. So I went ahead and I got two pizzas. If you get two pizzas, then for free you get a bag of chips, a um, this bottle of tea. They had unsweet tea and sweet tea, and I forgot to pull it back out again, but um, we also got this ice cream for free. 
And this Cookies Over Texas flavor is the best. It's just delicious. So, um, and it actually worked out really well for that to be the meal deal this week because we are having a family movie night tomorrow night. So we will be having the pizza and ice cream for our family movie night tomorrow. So that is all of our HEB stuff. So I'm gonna move over here to the Walmart side. So I went ahead and I got some almond milk this week for my coffee. And if there's any left, I might try to bring it with us. Uh, we'll have probably a little cooler or something in the car, so I might try to bring that with us. I also only got just a half gallon of our regular milk this week, um, just because I don't know if we will bring that with us, but I wanted to have some for our cereal, and um, my one-year-old still drinks that as well. Um, I got all these oatmeals, these oatmeal cups I thought would be really good for our breakfast while we're on the road. We're gonna be driving for three days, and so I thought that rather than having to stop for fast food or anything like that, I thought that these would be a really um, simple and filling thing for us to have that we can just eat at our Airbnb or we can get them ready and bring them in the car with us, um, things like that. So I also got these kind bars. I thought that those looked really good. And then I got these kind kids bars, which I, we haven't tried these before, but um, they look like something that my kids would really enjoy. So we got those for them. Uh, we also got just some whole carrots. We will cut these up this week. And again, whatever is left from them, we'll probably bring them in the car with us. And then same with our mandarin oranges, although we go through these pretty quickly. So I don't know if there will be any left by the time that we but that we leave this week. So, and I also got um, these deluxe mixed nuts. Uh, they're kind of expensive. I wanna say it was like over $13 for this, but it's a really good mix and it usually lasts a long time. And I thought that these would be really good um, for my husband and I to have on the road. And then I got this big box of goldfish crackers, which I will probably end up splitting up into uh, little baggies or something like that so that they will be easier to eat in the car but all my kids love goldfish crackers so had to get some of those for the road and then I also got these last week I had gotten a pair of these for my son uh, we're going to a lake house and so he needed some kind of sandals to wear and I got the wrong size last week and they were in blue which was the one that he wanted so I got the correct size this week but they didn't have any blue so we got the black ones and I think they're gonna be good. They're only 98 cents at Walmart, so you know, they'll just be good to play in and good for the beach. So, uh, so that was all my Walmart stuff. Moving over now, so these are the things that I got from Target yesterday just for activities for the car. And I wanna say, I don't have the exact total, but I wanna say I spent about $59 at Target. So um, I ended up getting, uh, I got these notebooks. I got one for my two bigger kids, just some blank notebooks for them to have in the car so they can do like a travel journal or draw pictures or sketch or whatever they wanna do. They had these, I wasn't gonna get any of this kind of stuff, but they had these colored pencils on sale yesterday. Um, they were uh, at least half off, if not even a little bit more than that. So I went ahead and got one of those for each of my older kids. And then I went ahead and got this for my three-year-old just to have a few crayons in the car. I did get her a coloring book and I didn't want to have too many crayons in the car because then they just kind of end up all over the place. But this way there's just eight crayons and we can hopefully keep track of those. So also for my three-year-old, I got this, this write and wipe um, book. She's been doing a lot of tracing and she's learned her letters. And so this is something that I think will be really fun for her and it comes with a little dry erase marker and so she can kind of work on that in the car and hopefully hopefully that won't be anything that'll be too messy or anything for her but that should keep her fairly busy also got her this coloring book to just go with the crayons that I got her and it comes also with some stickers she loves fancy Nancy so she has not seen this yet but I think she'll be really excited about that this book I got for my almost two year old. Um, he loves books, he just loves looking through them and this one is so cool, it's kind of raised. Um, it has these paint things and they all have texture and um, he's going to be sitting next to my eight year old so she can actually 
read to him while we drive and um, I think that he will really enjoy that. For my six-year-old son, he picked this out, this Mario Super, Super Mario official sticker book, and he is just extremely thrilled about it. He is just so excited. He can't wait to get into that. He is a huge fan of Mario, so um, he's really looking forward to that. And then this one here is what my uh, eight-year-old daughter picked out. She's been She's had her eye on this book for a while and she's been wanting it and so we went ahead and got this for her for the trip. I thought that that would be pretty fun for her to do and it should keep her pretty busy. It's a, it's a thick book and so she can probably work on this throughout our whole trip. And they also had a deal at Target as well and like that more educational kinds of books where if you bought one then you got one 40% off. So, um, so we got these two and got 40% off of one of them. So. Yeah, so those are the activities we're gonna bring in the car. We also left a little bit of wiggle room in our budget for that, so if we see things while we are out, then we can um, then we can get them. We can spend a little money while we're traveling and if we see things on the road. So, that is it. That is my grocery haul for this week. We're going to be eating through the stuff that we have in our house so that we're not leaving anything behind. And um, yeah, hopefully these snacks will do well for us on the road. I hope that you enjoyed today's video. Please like and subscribe, and we will be seeing you soon. Bye, guys.